Leander ISD is proud to recognize and celebrate these amazing students and their teachers, coaches, and mentors for achieving at the highest level. The Vandegrift girls golf team claimed the top spot in the UIL State 6A Golf Championship, separating themselves from the pack by finishing the two-day event six shots ahead of their closest competitor. Leading the Vipers with a two-day score of four under par, Sydney Givens snagged the silver medal in the individual ranks. A huge congratulations to Givens, Danica Lundgren, Brianna Hazy, Mimi Burton, and Eden McSpadden for their incredible accomplishment. On the boys' side, Cedar Park High School's Jonathan Kim worked his way onto the podium in the 5A championship by posting a monster score of five under par on the second day to pull into third place. What a great job out on the links. In the area of career and technical education, hashtag one LISD students continued to excel in state level competitions. At the Family, Career and Community Leaders of America State Leadership Convention, let's recognize those who placed in the top three at FCCLA. From Vandegrift High School, Leslie Zoom won first in entrepreneurship level two while VHS duo Jasmine Pucciatina and Abigail O'Brien finished in third place in Fashion Design Level 2. Cedar Park High School's Carrie Evans and Camden Michalik grabbed the top spot in Interior Design Level 3, and at Rouse High School, the team of Amy Valdivino, Maya Berry, and Ayla Murphy placed third in the Chapter Service Project Portfolio for Level 3. Also finishing third from Rouse was the team of Shruti Jashankar and Santoshi Akshida Penmetsa with a sustainability project portfolio for level three. We're wishing the best to those continuing on the next level at the FCCLA National Leadership Conference in July. Now let's celebrate the accomplishments of Hashtag One LISD's outstanding FFA programs from a variety of events throughout the year. From Glen High School, Alex Cunningham and Billy Gallagher finished in first in the Breed Champion at the Washington County Fair Show. Catalina Bello was the ninth sale qualifier at the prestigious Houston Livestock Show. And closer to home at the Williams County Livestock Show, Glen had two first places in rabbit breeding, Ava Sebring as the Grand Champion and Raiden Beatles as the Reserve Grand Champion. Congratulations also to Glenn's Carly Vincleric for receiving an American FFA degree. Cedar Park High School's Agricultural Communications team of Casey Miller, Jordan Jones, Kaysen Johnson, and James Sanderson placed third at a state career development event. Also from CPHS, Alex Trebilco's 2x72 belt grinder racked up awards as an Ag Mechanics Project, earning Reserve Division Champion and second in class at the San Antonio Livestock Show, along with third in class at the Houston Livestock Show. At Vandegrift High School, the Vet Science trio of Campbell Jordan, Spencer Jordan, and Kirsten Telmeland landed in third place at the State Career Development event. Congrats also go to Kirsten for finishing as the top individual. We will be cheering on those from around the district who advanced to the Texas FFA convention in Dallas in July. A number of Health Occupation Students of America, or HOSA participants, earned recognition at the state level. From Vandegrift High School, McKenna Kearns won the top prize for physical therapy. Also from VHS, Alexander Song received the Barbara James Service Award at the bronze level with more than 100 hours of community service. The Rouse High School team of Emily Wynn, Renu Yanam, and Charlotte Chen finished in second place at state in the PSA category. The Rouse trio of Bhuvani Lingineni, Radhika Singh, and Harshal Daduk were highlighted as being in the top 10 in the country in the Emotional Well-Being Challenge. And from Vista Ridge High School, Unche Kang took home third place at state in extemporaneous writing. Later this month, we will wish students good luck as they advance to the International Leadership Conference. The Skills USA competition recognizes students preparing for careers in trade, technical, and skilled service occupations, and Leander ISD is home to two state champs this year. From Rouse High School, William Chater finished first in automotive service technology. And from Leander High School, William Villatoro finished at the top of the National Electrical Code written test. 
Also from LHS, two teams grabbed second place state honors, Jet Estrada and Amira Mistkawi in additive manufacturing, and Paul Wei and Caden Sacco in 3D visualization and animation. Glen High School also featured a handful of state placers, including Cassidy Hausman and Taylor West for Felony Stop, Macy Penny, Christopher Johnson, and Anaid Jernigan for Forensic Science, and Zachary Davis for Criminal Justice. Good luck to those advancing to the National Skills USA Conference later this month. Rounding out this week's CTE honors, we now highlight students involved in the Texas Association of Future Educators, or TAFI, organization. From Leander High School, Sophia Denano finished second for public speaking. Vista Ridge High School had a pair of second place finishers, Emilia Prado for exploring support services, and Abigail Durbiano for lesson planning in STEM along with a pair of third place finishers, Isabel Federoff for lesson planning in humanities and Sophia Kessel for educators rising moment. Good luck to those advancing to the national conference at the end of this month. These students and their commitment to excellence has paved the way for remarkable achievements and an even brighter future here in hashtag one LISD.